Testing, testing. Microphone. It's your boy Sir FPV a lot, aka Sky Candy Visuals. And today, really quick, I just want to show you these new fresh, and I do mean fresh, 1.3 amp hour 100C 6S fly high FPV CNHL high power lipo battery packs. These things are sweet. Let's get a close up real quick of this sucker. OMG, that's beautiful. I couldn't pass up buying a few of these. Um, they're just beautiful. What makes them so great is the fact that not only are they covered in their normal uh, CNHL plastic like you see here, the regular plastic that always, for some reason, ends up coming off. Um, CNHL, you need to fix that. But these here have an extra coating on top of that, which is probably, if I'm not mistaken, some of this stuff here. Um, it's, it's basically really large. Uh, this is two inch um, heat shrink, if that's what you wanna call it. Heat shrink tubing, um, I'm not sure what size, probably two inches a little bit large for this. I don't know. I'll have to slide a couple of these normal ones in here and then heat them up and see how much it shrinks down to see what its uh, shrink rate is. But um, yeah, basically that's what's around this and it provides a lot extra durability on this bad boy so you're gonna get a lot more use out of it because not only is it not going to start peeling off and allowing your cells to separate which can cause them to ease, get more easily damaged but it also just kind of gives it a little extra barrier of uh, impact resistance you know so when they fall and hit the ground or or whatever from a crash they're not going to be impacted as hard as they as they do when they don't have that little extra layer because it's pretty thick if you can see that there it's pretty thick so yeah i'm excited to give these a good test shout out to fly high fpv.com if you want to get you some of these uh let me go ahead and put it on the scale really quickly didn't want to drag this video out but a normal uh, 1300 milliamp black series CNHL 6S 100C weighs approximately 196 grams. Fly high FPVs 1.3 amp hour, which is the same thing, 1300 milliamp uh, 100C 6S high power lithium polymer battery comes in at 197. Uh, sometimes I've put it on there and it said like 198 or sometimes it even said 200 but it went down to like 197 198 so it's it's basically like a gram maybe a gram and a half more than this bad boy fly high can cor correct me if I'm wrong in the comments but um, yeah this doesn't really add a lot of weight guys and plus if you're flying 6s <laughs> you don't care um, if you're like me flying 6s uh, seven inch or six inch drones or even five inch drones you don't care if um, you add a little bit of extra weight by putting this around your battery now what I also recommend on top of this is putting a little strip of the velcro on one side and then putting the the opposite velcro strap on your top plate and then that way or whether if you're if you're running bottom plate mounted put it on the bottom and then that way when you stick your drone down not only is it secured by that velcro but this stuff is um, it's it's a lot grippier than 
than this is right here. So obviously these packs look way cooler with the sticker that's on here, but this material, this um, heat shrink that is under the sticker, if you were to peel this off, is a lot more grippy um, for your, let's see, like this. Now, obviously, Flyha is not going to like this because, you know, you're, you're getting rid of his free advertising there. But this material versus this sticker is a lot more grippy for um, your battery strap and being um, mounted onto your drone. It, it gives you a lot better grip than the standard slick like if i if i put this in your hand and you felt it versus feeling this it's got like some friction to it it's got a grip because it's it's rubber so it uh yeah and i have some um other material in mind that i'm going to be trying on some of my other batteries that are that are not the cnhl i'm going to be trying some um tire inner tubes those are extremely thicker than this and very grippy. They have a lot of grip. So um, when you crash really hard, your battery is not going to ejecto cedo cuzzo out of your um, uh, battery strap and top plate or bottom plate, however you're mounting it. So yeah, I know that's not the best thing because, you know, obviously Fly High had this really cool uh, design put on there which I love repping fly high that's the whole reason I'm even making this video so it's nothing against fly high um, this logo is the shit and uh, you know I don't fly crazy like that to even really care about having that much gription but I'm just letting you know that you know this material that's under here is terrific for uh, gripping against your battery strap, especially if you use the battery straps that I use, which are race day quads. <laughs> Oops. Um, but really, it's any battery strap with these uh, sticky inner materials. Uh, this is always on the inside where the battery lays so that it wraps around your drone and the sticky part is on your um drone so the rotor riot battery straps have this sticky material the uh ethics the ethics straps have this sticky material theirs isn't that sticky basically no matter if it's the rotor riot battery strap the ethics battery strap or the race state quads battery strap anybody's battery strap that comes with this um sticky material this this um I don't know it's kind of like a, a TPU I don't know it's it's weird it's like a very thin film of like rubbery thin plastic material that I don't know it just it's sticky so it's it's really grippy when it comes to grabbing your battery but if you put it against a battery pack with a sticker on it or a you know labeling on it versus taking the labeling off and gripping it on the uh, heat shrink itself <laughs> the the gription is like two times better I'm telling you it's it's awesome so you know do that at your own discretion of you know if you want to take this sticker off your batteries um, that's not going to work on these because uh, this plastic on the regular ones is even more slick than the sticker is. So, yeah, that's not really going to help you there. What you're going to have to do is wrap it in your own material, your own heat shrink that has this same texture to it which I will be um, making a video on this soon. So make sure you subscribe on um, Sky Candy Visuals so that you can see that video coming up on if this works or not. Uh, 
I'll be testing this out on some of my other packs, even some large packs too, bigger than these packs. And we're just gonna see if like, you know, this actually works and holds up. But you can see here that this is the same exact material. It's like a, I don't know, the texture of it is just way better than um, any sticker or slick plastic that comes on most batteries. So you wrap your batteries in this by just, you know, sticking your pack in there and sizing it properly. Now you wouldn't have to do that on fly highs because they're already done for you. So they're saving you the time and effort and money because this was not cheap. Uh, I believe I bought this for about 25 bucks from Amazon Prime. But on packs that that uh, don't have it, you know, you could take this sticker off and then shove your pack in there, cut it to length and then heat it with a uh, heat gun to shrink it down and make it look just like this one. And then you got a, a good grippy pack ready to go with your grippy battery strap and then you're not gonna eject Cedo cuzzo. So anyways, now that I've said all that, um, these packs are the shit. Shout out to Fly High. Um, let's go ahead and open a box so you can see what it looks like in the box and how it comes packaged because they come very well packaged. Don't get it twisted because it's coming from Fly High, uh, who is always high. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'll just fuck it with you, Fly. Uh, don't get it twisted. These packs come professionally packaged just like the regular ones. Um, don't think that because they're Fly High's versions that they're going to be any different. No, they come in the same exact box in the same exact bubble wrap, taped up, and um, you if, with Fly High, you even get an XT30 uh, 3D printed cover for like if you're going to take your packs on planes or something like that, or some people like to even have these just when they're storing them in their LiPo bags or in their drone book bag. So it comes professionally packaged, ready for you to uh, charge it and rip it um, right out of the box yeah and that is the fly high FPV 1300 amp hour um, 1300 milliamp 1 1.3 amp hour packs they are awesome go and get you some if you don't have any already I will say that fly high shipping is a little higher than what I'm used to from most places. Like if I'm buying stuff from Race Day Quads or um, Get FPV or Amazon or wherever I'm getting it from, Ethics, uh, TV, Team Black Sheep, wherever, I'm, I'm not biased to anyone. So don't think that this video is me trying to like promote fly, fly high. He's a cool ass motherfucker. I fuck with Fly High, so yes, I am making this video, but I'm not doing it because I want to say that these packs are, um, you know, the best. Uh, as far as being durable, they're probably the best, but that's yet to be known yet. We're going to have to t put them to the test and see. But anyways, what I'm trying to say is, is I wasn't paid in any way to do this or uh, these batteries, I bought them with my own money. They were not given, given to me, so I'm not gonna be biased. I'm gonna give you my true opinion. And what I'm letting you know is that when you shop on Fly High's website, he doesn't really have a set point of price range when you buy a certain amount of things. So say you buy 10 of these batteries, once you go over a certain range, you don't get free shipping. It's it's pretty much going to be what the shipping is. He's got a set set point on the shipping. So for instance, so I bought three of these packs and the shipping ended up being about 15 bucks. So you just have to take into consideration that no matter where you go, even if you're going to buy some CNHL black series packs from like some other website that does give free shipping after you buy a certain amount 
you're not going to get this pack. You're not going to get this pack that's already been perfectly wrapped for you with the durable um, heat shrink. And so you're kind of paying for that convenience by paying that shipping that Fly, Fly High has on this website. On flyhigh.com, if you buy a certain amount of batteries, I think it might start at around, I don't know, somewhere between five to 10 batteries. Once you get a certain amount of batteries, it's listed on a site, you do get a discount. I think it's like, uh, depending on how many you're buying, it's like a dollar per battery or two dollars per battery once you start to get a certain amount of batteries. So he does give you a coupon for that. So you do get a discount. Um, so I know I was talking about the shipping and how it costs a little more, but if you're gonna buy in bulk a quantity from him, you do get a discount. So I just wanted to put that out there so that you guys would know about that and that you don't think that you just shouldn't go there to buy anything because of the shipping. The shipping is insignificant. Um, you do get a discount, so there's that. Every day is Black Fly Day at flyhighfpv.com. Always got the deals on the batteries, 24-7, 365 days a year. Um, you know, I've talked to him about it before. He doesn't have like a certain amount. You could buy 50 of these from him. You're still going to pay shipping. That I kind of don't like. I wish that like if you bought a certain amount of things, you could get free shipping like with other companies. Like uh, for instance, I shop at Race Day Quads a lot. If I buy a certain amount of things there over a certain amount of set dollar, the shipping becomes free. Or if I buy lipos on Amazon, usually it's if I have since I have Prime, it's usually free. But that's neither here nor there. These packs are awesome. Fly High is awesome, and I just want to put it out there to you like it is. You will be paying fifteen dollars uh, or possibly more shipping if you buy some of these. So keep that in mind. You're paying a little extra, but. Not only do you get to support Fly High, which is a cool ass dude, by buying these, but you also get this protective heat shrink that is going to make your packs more durable and it's already done for you so you don't have to do it yourself because it does cost you money to buy that heat shrink and it takes you time to put it on. So is it worth it? I can't really say. Right now I will make more video, like I said, on this heat shrink. Um, I'll let you know how much foot feet this is um, and how many packs I get to wrap out of it and um, you know whether it's it's holding up as good as fly highs heat shrink is um, and all that good stuff so just stay tuned for future videos if you're interested in stuff like that but just know that when you're buying packs from flyhigh.com there is that shipping that is there so unless you work out something with him I don't know but as far as I know there is shipping so keep that in mind um, other than that that's it for this video uh, stay tuned if you're interested in microphone things because I do have some microphone videos coming soon uh, the, the zoom h1n handy recorder my wife got me this for Father's Day so yeah um, I can't wait to do a um, comparison audio comparison with that um, compared to some other little budget microphones that I got I got a lavalier uh, microphone here that is called the uh, pop voice microphone I'm gonna compare it to that I also got another lavalier microphone, which is a pretty good one by Boya. Uh, we're gonna try it with that, compare it with that. And I also got the one that I'm wearing right now that you're listening to. So I don't know if you could tell a difference from my previous videos of me talking. If I sound any different, let me know in the comments if I sound better or worse. Um, because yeah, I hooked this up. It's connected to my recording camera and from what I've seen so far and listened to, it sounds pretty good. It sounds way better than me talking to you 
from either over here or over there or wherever I'm at and you m telling the difference when I move around that I'm further away from the camera. So this is always with me and you're hearing the same exact uh, distance of voice at all times. So, and hopefully it just sounds a little more professional. So I can't wait to get the lavaliers plugged into this thing and that's when supposedly you can really get detailed on the sound and um, I guess what would you call it the uh, post post production of uh, audio quality like editing the audio quality um, you know with an equalizer or whatnot and making everything sound really good and crisp ready for uh, for for production. Yeah guys, so that's it for this video. If you hear what I sound like now, that's without the pop uh, lavalier microphone. So that gives you an idea of the difference in quality. Um, stay tuned for those videos in the future. This is your boy Sir FDV a lot, aka Scott Candy Visuals. Hope you enjoy this. If you do, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, comment down below, whatever you might want to say. If I got anything wrong, make sure you comment that down below so everybody can know the truth. I appreciate you guys. Holla at your boy. I'm out. Thank you so much, Kenny. Love you guys.